lots of initiatives come out over the last 10, 15 years. Oh, we, we're really going to listen to young people, we're really going to take this forward. Nothing seems to have changed much. This time it comes from the young people, so it's not top down, it's equity throughout, so everyone's got shared responsibility. Um, and then the young people can see that, they can face the partners and they can challenge them themselves. And that's what's really great about it. That pathway for them to be involved in their services, in their designer services, have their say taken into account. They're just phenomenal. The stuff they come up with, honestly, is remarkable. Like, I'm so proud of them, it's, it's wicked. I guess uh, working with young people across RCT is a commitment and a priority for um, all partners, whether the funding comes through or not. It's about sharing skills, sharing experiences, and also sharing issues that young people are facing, because we're asking their views all the time, we're asking their opinions, but it's like acting on them, making sure that something is actually going to come out of it. And the fact that we're discussing the long-term kind of implications of working together and reaching young people across RCT just shows that we're all in the same place. And I think for us as services, we have to be open to uh, scrutiny and change from young people. We have to allow them to examine us and look at how we can do things better. Making sure that we're not just it in one generation, we're it in generations for years to come. A lot of services think the young people led, but with this partnership it really does feel like it is being led by young people. It will draw on the strengths um, and the areas of expertise of all of those organisations. We've been talking about what, what they want, how they want to see the world and how they want to leave a world for people who will come after them as well. And it's about getting the right people and the right organisations and the groups so we can offer um, as wide a service to young people as possible. Everyone in the room needs to give that, that commitment to them and if we do that, they will make a tomorrow out of today which will be absolutely brilliant for everybody who follows and and that is what the young people that I've been talking to actually want. I would like them to see the passion that these young people have got to change their lives and future young people's lives. The need is there, it's, it's really evident from speaking to young people. They tell me exactly what they think and that is what we need to change services across Romacan and Jeff. The young people of RCT are absolutely amazing. So are the partners. They're really trying and they're willing. It emphasises how important these, every young person is. And that needs to be reiterated across RCT. So the young people want to think, oh, I, I can't do that. Yes, I can. Yes, you can. And there's a means to help you do that. W without the funding, it's the, it, it may not happen without the funding. We may not be able to give young people a voice. We may not be able to reach young people that really need an opportunity to engage. So that's why I think actually by funding this project, it, it really will change lives on the ground and, and that's really important. <laughs>